well, but you know what? <laughs> okay, it's a product. It's a product. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. As you can see in the title down below, this is my favorite cleansers video and I'm talking about facial cleansers. The reason why is because you guys know that I do uh, with like my favorite uh, face oils, body oils, blah, 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 all that jazz. Um, I'm gonna continue with that and show you some of my favorite cleansers. These are facial cleansers. And I kind of thought that it's very important to do this kind of video because at the end of the day, if you're somebody who wears makeup, you know how important cleansers are. It depends on what kind of cleanser that you use, but cleansers are really, really important, especially when it comes to um, your makeup and removing your makeup at the end of every day. So cleansers come in different types. There are some cleansing foams, there are cleansing balms, there are cleansing oils, there are cleansing... Um, they call them facial soaps, but it's also like a cleansing oil type of thing. And they come in all sorts of different types, shapes, sizes, and from different brands. Also, what I do consider as a cleansing step to cleansing your face is also a, um, what do you call these things? Facial wipes. I'm somebody who uses facial wipes, especially on the days where I feel like, oh, I am too tired. I could not be bothered. If I'm walking into the house at 1 a.m., I could not be bothered with cleansing my face and doing a two-step cleanse at 2 a.m. So facial wipes are an important part of my cleansing regimen as well. So if you would like to see some of my favorite cleansers, then you know what to do. Definitely do. Keep watching. Gun, 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 gun. <laughs> So this is not going to be in any order of importance, but the first two I want to get out of the way because I've probably spoken about these two cleansers so much or cleansing systems or whatever. So much that you guys are probably sick of it, but it's this two, these two from the same brand. I love these two. This is my cleansing step one and this is my cleansing step two. So this is on my lazy days. These are the Garnier Skin Active Micellar Infused Cleansing Water, which is the one with the oil. And this is the Micellar Infused Cleansing Wipes, oil infused cleansing wipes. First things first, these things smell absolutely amazing. Both of them, I absolutely love them. And because I've been shaking this one around, you can't really see, but what happens is the oil separates from the solution. And what um, you will see is like, there'll be a two-tone color. As you can see, it's already starting to form. The oil will be at the top, the solution will be at the bottom. And what you do is you pretty much shake it up first, and then you put it onto a cotton pad and you remove. But this is normally, uh, the second step. The first step I would go in with these and this I use every single day irrespective of whether I'm going to follow with this or if I'm going to follow with my other cleansers which I'm going to show you now. I love these wipes. I have never come across anything better. I've tried the uh, Cetaphil ones which are really expensive but I feel like are too abrasive on my skin. I used to use the Johnson's one, but um, I feel like these ones are a lot softer on my skin. I have tried the Neutrogena ones, which I feel like are a little bit too wet for my liking. These are just perfect and they smell absolutely amazing. You can use them for your eyes, lips. They are non greasy. They are absolutely amazing. You remove everything like this goes in one wipe. I can remove my whole face layer first layer of makeup and then i can follow with this and i absolutely love them they are cleansing tools so i did want to mention these these are from garnier so you can find them at clicks and discam and yeah girl you're good to go and then the next cleansing uh products that i really really am into quite a lot i i bought this a couple of months ago but i try them it's pretty much like i think it's halfway yeah it's halfway i try different cleansers all the time because i like to keep my skin guessing i really don't like to use one cleanser the whole time i think skin sort of gets used to products if you use one thing for like eight to ten months it's just like ugh, you start to not see the difference in any way but a cleanser is just a cleanser you're just removing your makeup to be honest but i really love this one if you're somebody with sensitive skin this event gentle milk cleanser oh my god i don't know if it smells nice let's it just smells like honestly a normal moisturizing lotion from a vein or very subtle it's got a very very subtle scent which is not uh, pungent in any way but I love this one it's very very 
similar to the cleansing milk from Clarins as well. It's great especially for people with dry skin which my skin tends to get real dry in winter. I will see all the marks right here, right here. I, it's just, it's a mess, it's a mess. But I really really like this one because I use this one as a second step or I'll go in the first time around with a full face of makeup on and then go in a second time around after rinsing and yeah and then it did just a double cleanse but it works so so well i love this one because it is also they include it's very rich with the aven thermal water as well so if you're somebody who loves the aven thermal water you like this product purely because aven products are very very good for sensitive skin and then two products from clinique uh let's start with the facial soap first now i love this facial soap i i <coughs> I feel sad because it doesn't really get much love from me even on my social media or anything like that but a lot of the time when I am switching between products or I've run out of my favorite cleanser or what have you I will always gravitate towards this and this has a lifespan of two years so honey okay a little goes a long way with this and as we know Clinique is really really good with people with um, sensitive skin as well this is the liquid facial soap and mild it's sort of like a mixture of a gel uh, like uh, solution it's it's like a gel yeah isn't it yeah it's like a gel and what you do is you squirt some onto your hand and then and then remove and then you do a double cleanse but I feel like this one is really really good and this is also for dry combination skin so I gravitate towards this one a lot in the winter time because in summer I feel like it's very stripping on my skin but in winter it works perfectly because my skin tends to get really dry so I'll go and I'll feel that my skin is actually quite dry but this is actually such a great great product I definitely do recommend this one I haven't shown you much love girl but you know <laughs> Okay, good, it's a product. It's a product. All right, and then the next one is a well-loved product. This is a product that that. Go, what you trying to say? This is a product that I keep repurchasing all the time. I don't even, I don't mind because the price for this product, for what it does, is really, really good as well. Uh, it's around the 250, 280 mark, somewhere there, and it's a cleansing balm. So that's what it looks like on the inside. It's just white. This is a new one that I recently purchased. I love this product. I absolutely, oh man. I really love it. The only thing that I don't like about this product, if it gets into your eyes, <laughs> let's say if it gets into your eyes, that time there's somebody walking around your house, let's like it's just, you know, somebody walking around the house or somebody enters your room, like my sister enters my room while I'm busy washing. For a good 10 seconds, if it gets into my eyes, I won't see her. It literally it blurs out your vision it doesn't really sting per se like that much but it blurs your vision it's so so bad it makes me feel so insecure every time I use it <laughs> when I think about you know my paranoia but a lot of the time I'll just you know now it doesn't bother me at all because I've learned to keep it very very far away from my eyes so I'll pretty much start like here below here and then go 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 and it's really really great it's creamy as soon as you take it out of the and you warm it into your hands it goes into an oil like formation and then as soon as it hits the heat of your hands or your face to hand it goes into an uh, sort of like an oil like um consistency and it just removes makeup like a dream sometimes i rub it and then i remove it with a facial wipe or sometimes i rub it on and then rinse it off and then come in again with a double cleanse it removes everything it's amazing they, they don't lie about this one i really promise they don't lie it's one of the best 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 out there i love it and then the last product is a product that i got referred to by my friend kalenga this is the estee lauder perfectly clean multi-action cream cleanser this thing ne? let's start by oof, it's wet because it lives in my shower let's start by saying it smells amazing i have never come across something that smells so chic it just smells nice it smells it's got this subtle but very really really nice you could eat it you know when something smells so good you could eat it that this is that this is that absolutely love 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 this cleanser it's great because you can use it as a cleanser or you can use it as a moisture mask as well so on days that I have makeup on and I jump into the shower, maybe in the evenings, what is my lash doing? On days where I have makeup on and I jump into the shower in the evenings, I will use this. Um, it's great, but one thing, one thing, eh? One thing. 
it burns the heck out of your eyes. You! You, 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 you. And the thing is, when you're in the shower, obviously you're gonna do this and then you're gonna, you know, all over your face, including on top of your eyes and on top of your lids and things like that. But should this thing even, just a tint of manana, tint, get into your eyes, are you in trouble? Ah, baby, in trouble. It burns, it burns. That's the sucky part about it, but it leaves my skin feeling so soft and smooth. It's amazing. None of these products leave my skin feeling the way that this product leave my, leaves my skin. Yes, Mrs. Slow. So I love, love, love this product. Definitely recommend it. It lasts such a long time. This is my second one, but I think my first one maybe probably lasted me like six to eight months. So I, like genuinely, I really, really, really love this product and I think definitely recommend. If you've got some splurging money there, splurge and use this. And this one, the great thing about it is that it's suitable for all skin types. Absolutely one of my favorites. I love them. I love them. That's it from me. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you would like to see other faves of mine in terms of cleansers, lotions, moisturizing, body lotions, da, 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 da. I love to give you guys my recommendations and I absolutely love the ones that are here. I repurchase all of the ones that are here. So I'm going here because they're on the floor right here. <laughs> so if you would like to see any other video in terms of my favorites, in terms of skincare or makeup, bathroom, whatever, doesn't matter. Let me know. I'll definitely get onto that for you. But until the next time, I will see you soon soon. Bye.